Good morning. Um, I would like to say ahead of time, please excuse my um, my voice, because um, it is uh, 3 a.m. here, and it seems like when I when I wake up uh, early, my voice starts out deep and uh, I'm not waking up for the day I just uh, I had a lot on my mind and I feel like I had maybe a revelation and I wanted to uh, I wanted to make a video while it's fresh on my mind uh, and then go back to bed um, so I'm sorry if this is a little random because I don't know exactly what I'm going to say so hopefully the Lord Jesus Christ uh, can help me uh, with, I don't know, explaining with what, um, maybe a revelation, maybe this is a revelation, um, and, and any time that I, um, I think of something that may be clever or, um, an epiphany, I guess some people would call it, uh, I don't I, I don't take credit for it for sure it's definitely um, something that the Lord God graces me with because you know he <clears throat> um, yeah he helps me and guides me since I've given my life to him um, so again I don't take any credit if if this comes out uh, intelligent or, or, <laughs> or wise or, or anything of that sort. Oh, hold on. Again, it's 3 a.m., so please excuse me. So I'll, I'll, get, I'll get on with what I wanted to um record before I go back to bed so I was talking to someone on the phone today and when I got off the phone with her um, I was a little bit saddened because uh, I know that uh, she's really in the system still that when I speak to this person, it's as though they are under hypnosis. Um, and then it occurred to me that, uh, you know, the, the symbol for hypnosis, um, they use a spiral symbol. And um, I, when I was writing the notes down, I'm not sure. Yeah, so I was writing these notes, and I know it's going to be backwards, so I apologize. Uh, or it may record backwards, I don't know. So I was, I, I, I got up just a few minutes ago, and I just quickly jotted that down on paper, um, that... Yes, so when somebody, uh, when you think of somebody or you think of hypnosis, you think of a spiral. And then um, I was thinking about, I um, was watching different people's videos and they were saying that people who are satanic uh, love the spirals. Like they'll have designs like spiral designs. You know, and I'll see it in some people's decorations in their yard. 
you know, a spiral. And, um, and then, uh, it occurred to me because I, you know, being in the truth, you learn that, um, that witchcraft does, in fact, exist, that it's not, uh, it's not fictional in, in just movies that people who are satanic, um, or refer to themselves as uh, Wiccan or witches that they do actually they do spells on people uh, so there is symbolism uh, everywhere in my notes that I just showed you even on your computer the at symbol on your computer is a spiral an A with a, a, a circle around it that makes a spiral so um, so yes so I believe in my heart that um, that those that seem to be in deep into the matrix um, are under a spell um, and even our language, as I wrote down in my notes really quick here, even our language, uh, it, it could be um, forms of spells that are upon people. Because when uh, those of us who speak freely, we don't all necessarily uh, think about the things that we say. But when I was on this track of spirals, I was thinking of the language that we use and yes so a couple of the um, words or phrases that I, I wrote down was things like winds up or winds down um, turns out or the word around or stirred up uh, running in circles or when somebody's life gets out of control, we say stuff like spiraling down. Oh, my jaw just clicked. Did you hear that? <laughs> um, which I thought was really interesting. And again, it's 3 a.m. So I, I only wrote this down on a small piece of paper. So um, I don't, um, I'm sure that there are plenty other words and phrases that that lead to this spiral. Uh, so yes, yeah, so I was talking to this person that yes, is very much part of the matrix, very much part of this, this illusion, this dream, this hypnosis. And that's, that's really what it is that, that the, what we uh, presume is reality is not reality at all. It's a dream. It's a nightmare. Um, at least I think it's a nightmare. <laughs> um, or you, you realize, uh, okay, so I don't, I didn't look at my whole life as a nightmare. Um, not at all. Um, what I'm saying is when you come into the truth, the more truth that you um, are aware of, uh, the more that you realize that you have been completely lied to and, um, nobody likes to be lied to that, uh, you, you realize that you have been purposely distracted your whole life um, with one end goal, and that is for your eternal soul. So when I say that, you know, it's a nightmare, I mean, it, it very well can be, uh, someone's nightmare if you are not saved by the Lord Jesus Christ, that, you know, the end game, your eternal soul, you're either going to go one way or the other. So, um, no, I don't think that, you know, uh, 
I don't want people to think that, you know, oh, I'm, I'm trying to be a, a downer. There you go, down, like spiraling down. It's so weird, right? And even your DNA, that's interesting. Even your DNA is, is like a spiraling staircase. So I think there is definitely something to this spiral. So again, I just wanted to do a, a video uh, of this revelation. And again, I don't take any credit whatsoever. Um, I just, I give all credit to the Lord Jesus Christ, especially if it's clever or there's something to it. I don't, um, come up with these ideas. Definitely. I don't come up with these ideas on my own. So, yeah. So if you do not have the full armor of God, and you are not saved, I imagine that this hypnosis, these symbols that they have with spirals and the language that we use, they, I, I believe, I really wholeheartedly believe they are spells. Just like when you pray to the Lord Jesus Christ, um, it is like counteracting, uh, um, uh, the the witchcraft that it is a higher vibration a higher frequency that it is a lot more powerful than you know Satan and spell casting uh, it's like undoing so when you when the Lord Jesus Christ makes you a new creation and you have eyes to see I I believe it's not just um, it's not just a literal, you have eyes to see, it is also, you have more insight to, um, you see things at a different perspective, um, and you're able to, um, yeah, you know where I'm going with this. <laughs> And it's 3 a.m. Like you, like you have eyes to see, you have a better understanding. The 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 Lord Jesus Christ opened your eyes and and you are able to yes look at things um um in with a wiser um yes. So oh and even a snake. You know when a snake is like coiled up in like a resting place that it's a spiral. That's another, I see, I, 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 I probably could go on and on and um, whoever's watching this video, I'm sure you could probably come up with a lot of other things that has to do with the spiral. So there's something to it. Again, uh, if this is a revelation, um, I take no credit whatsoever. I just thought it was interesting that one conversation that I had with someone that it, um, it evolved into this thought process. So, um, I don't know. Again, I just wanted to make a quick video to share it before, uh, before, like while it was fresh, before I forget about it, because I'm definitely one of those people where, you know, I can walk into a room when <laughs> I'm about to do something and I walk into a room and I'm like, uh, what did I come in here for? <laughs> So yes, without the Lord Jesus Christ helping me, <laughs> I'm, I'm useless. <laughs> Anyhow, um, I hope you have a very good day. And yes, um, I'm, it's interesting. I, I, um, yeah, if anything, I find it interesting and I thought that others may find this interesting too. So I hope you have a very good day and God bless.